मैं एक बार किसी दोस्त के रूम पे चला गया था तो देवर प्लेइंग सम सॉन्ग वो बहुत मजे ले रहे थे ऐसे करके आ क्या बोला ऐसे कौन है कह रहा है कौन है गुलाम अली साहब है ऐसे करके second mic which was your favorite player my favorite was levo long and marshall long grew up with bruce lee and jackie chan kind of heroes right so anybody with kung fu abilities i didn't like kickboxers or i didn't like the boxers or the judo or the no no i need somebody to wo chahiye thoda sa i think one place i find myself speaking aloud wo ek time pe main zor se bolta hu kid wo time hota hai jab main baitha hu kuch dekh raha hu tv pe kuch chal raha hai i'm enjoying it i'm like hmm kuch khana chahiye ये मैं जोर से बोलता हूँ इवन वेन यूर अलो हेलो कुछ खाना चाहिए सब टाइम लाइक मैगी है उसके बारे में मैंने चलचित्र पे भी बहुत बातें की है बट इन आर एपिसोड वी गॉट टू टॉक अबाउट थिंग्स बियॉन्ड दो मूवीज बियॉन्ड दो शोज आपने उनका ऐसा रूप किसी और वीडियो में इंटरनेट पर नहीं देखा होगा सो यू आर गोइंग टू हैव अ फन फन राइड एंड बहुत सारी इंटरेस्टिंग रिकमेंडेशन है बट लाइक आपको ना पेन एंड पेपर लेके बैठने की जरूरत नहीं है बिकॉज वी हैव सॉट इट समथिंग फॉर यू आज कल हम जो भी चलचित्र टॉक्स पर रिकमेंड करते हैं वी अपलोड दोज रिकमेंडेशन ऑन नोकियो नोकियो लेटली हैज बिकम वन ऑफ माई फेवरेट ऐप्स क्योंकि जैसे ही मेरी कोई मूवी या शो खत्म होता है मैं वहाँ पर जाके उसका रिव्यू लिखता हूँ एंड या यू विल गेट टू सी सो मेनी अमेजिंग रिकमेंडेशन दे आई थिंक कुछ लोग आप में से पहले से हमें नोकियो पर फॉलो करते हैं बट अगर अभी तक आप नहीं करते यू गैज आम मिसिंग आउट सो गो एंड क्लिक ऑन द डिस्क्रिप्शन एंड लाइक आपकी सारी प्रॉब्लम्स का एक सोल्यूशन है नोकियो बिकॉज नॉट जस्ट चलचित्र टॉक्स आप जितने फिल्म पेजेस फॉलो करते हैं वो सब नोकियो you pay and you are going to have a hell of a ride if you follow everyone there so yes let's jump right inside the amazing amazing episode i did with vijay verma end tak dekhna because main aapko end mein kuch aur updates dunga chal chitra ke bare mein and yeah must coffee coffee bana ke chalu karo aaj ka hamara episode with vijay verma hi vijay how are you welcome to chal chitra talks thank you so much मैं बहुत टाइम से ये एपिसोड चाह रहा था हो जाए एटलीस्ट एक साल से ये मेरी लाइक एक ख्वाहिश थी कि लाइक वी मेक दिस एपिसोड हैपन बिकॉज आई एम अ बिग फैन ऑफ योर वर्क थैंक यू सो मच और मोस्टली मैं ट्राई करता हूँ जब मैं कोई इस एपिसोड करूँ ना मैं ये नहीं बोलूँ कि सर फैन हो <laughs> वो थोड़ा सा क्वेश्चन ऐसी हो जाती है बट आई डोंट नो एवर सिंस आई हैव सीन द हार्ड आई हैव बीन वेरी वोकल अबाउट द फैक्ट हाउ इट इज़ वन ऑफ द बेस्ट परफॉर्मेंसेज ऑफ ऑल टाइम फ्रॉम इंडिया तो मेरे को बहुत ज़्यादा पसंद है आपकी द हार्ड की परफॉर्मेंस थैंक यू थैंक यू सो मच मैंने कुछ और सोचा था कि हाउ आई स्टार्टेड बट आई जस्ट टेल यू द वन ऑफ माय फेवरेट सीन्स ऑफ योर्स इन द हार्ड इज जब आपका जो बेटा होता है और उसका जब वो फ़ोन पकड़ में आ जाता है जब घर आते हो यू गो टू हिज रूम एंड आपको लग रहा होता है पापा बोलेगा थप्पड़ मारेंगे कुछ करेंगे और बच्चे को जाके बोलता है अगर आपने ऐसा कुछ वापस किया ना तो पापा आपको छोड़ के चले जाएंगे एंड आई वॉज लाइक आप कभी ऐसे सुनते नहीं हो राइट लाइक दिस इज सच अस वे ऑफ गोइंग अबाउट इट इट्स द वर्स्ट line yeah. I told on screen <laughs> and i remember reema wanted this and i think she was so clear that this is the worst thing you can tell the child yeah man and isne reema must have spoken about this to me several times every time i met her you know you tell your kid to just like i'll just go away and it'll be on you and that's the worst thing you can do to a child oh, man. you know ki you are blamed yeah ओ मुझे तो बहुत बट शी काइंड ऑफ न्यू दैट दिस दिस हैड टू एंड वो लैंड करता है वैसे कि मैं ऐसे लगे अगर मेरे को ऐसा बोल देते तो मेरी तो या एंड यू लुक एट दैट बॉय इन दैट शो एंड यू हार्ट ब्रेक्स यू नो या सो या या अब आई वांट टू टॉक अबाउट लाइक दिस ग्रे शेड कैरेक्टर्स आपके फेवरेट विलेंस ऑफ ऑल टाइम कौन है फ्रॉम इंडियन इंडस्ट्री फ्रॉम इंडिया आई थिंक I was very fascinated by what Paresh Rawal was doing. Uh he was doing very comic villains. Yeah. Which were very interesting. Yeah. They were really funny. Yeah. Wo daud picture mein yeah uh, andaaz apna apna mein he's not yeah. like yeah I feel like he played with it so beautifully you know. 
and uh, he invented characters i like comical villains more than the villain villain because i don't look at life as villains and heroes you know i like antagonists nice uh, i like uh, i don't think pushpa is a hero story it's an antagonist right. story right. divar is an antagonist right. it's not a protagonist right um so i relate with that and fallen is also an antagonist you ah. can look at it because it's the protagonist is sonakshi and all the right yeah people on the cop in the station and then there have somebody who is antagonizing them throughout yeah and even in darlings it's a proper antagonist yeah. to the story yeah so i never enjoyed like uh, the label of uh, characters in that which was a trend for years in bollywood hmm. ki yes and it was the funniest thing is vasan bala trying to make a film called side hero oh. which was actually a thing can you believe Haan. it just two decades ago ha ye hero hai ya side hero hai ha so we've got rid of something like yeah. that yeah. you know so we come a long way i feel yeah so villain is also kind of a dated concept according to me right ha mogambo was a villain yeah shakal was a villain yeah uh, but those movies are not getting made yeah a uh, cinema has changed i feel like pacino when he came did yeah. scarface that changed everything right now every actor wants to do a pacino a scarface yeah, yeah. and sabka ek wo now breaking bad ho gaya so walter white is an antagonist not the villain yeah aur sab like uh, aur tv shows jab aap karte ho jab aap shows karte ho i think you get more time to spend with that character yeah so aap zyada khel sakte ho see yeah like uh, if you bring up uh, this one gus is the ultimate antagonist in the story or the villain in the story yes and in uh, better call saul it's uh, lalo salamanca yeah yeah uh, but at some point you they take you inside lalo's life also yeah. and you're like ki ye gutter mein raha hai yes ye chupke akela sab kuch kar raha hai sab kuch he wants his revenge and revenge is a very natural response yes you know it's a very human um, you know feeling ki mere sath kuch bura hua main dunga sakti ha ha so wo uh, so you get into their their heads and heads and hearts which is interesting yeah i also want to ask you ki aapka initial movies ke sath rishta kya tha which is your first movie watching memory uh, i think it was on television only i don't remember which film i remember watching a very a film that moved me i think it was an animation film on dinosaurs and you see their life and then a the meteor comes and everything goes away and they told it through a mother and a child kind of an angle so i got very invested and emotional huh. in that whole story i got fascinated by the world i don't really know kya thi wo film and i remember watching sadma which was playing on television yeah. when i was a little boy and it really like did something to me uh. Uh, it was so much beauty and cuteness and innocence and simplicity in that film but at the same time it moved me there was so much pathos there was great deal of uh, sadness like that end was so like, i yeah. cried as a little boy you know yeah when i saw uh, kamala san yeah uh, try to make her remember who he is and he did all those tricks mm. and it was such a beautiful performance and so those were those are my early early so but aise dekhe honge gaane aur ye sab dekha hoga but something that affected me affected me was 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 these movies and i used to be scared of uh, silk smita silk smita ke ek track aata hai sadma mein when uh, kamala san goes to the city hmm. to do something yeah. and he's seduced by this really dark hmm. uh, seductive uh, dark in the energy seductive uh, lady and i and being a little boy i was like ki ye kaun hai ye iska bura chahti hai iske sath kuch ah uh, so yeah it was uh, it was very interesting and which is the first film jo aapko memory ho theater mein jo dekhi ho like theater going memory theater mein isme aapko meri batata hu like i had seen fir bhi dil hai hindustani i was in first standard oh. meri memory ho hai aur uh, main teen char schools mein apply yeah. kiya hua tha and uh, i am the best gana aata hai usme i am the best ah. and aur mere ko mere parents bata rahe dekhte ko all the best bol rahe and mai pagal ho gaya mera admission ho jayega all the best all the best oh <laughs> to fir bhi the, yeah like that is like my first like theater memory mai kabhi nahi bhul sakta hu <laughs> yeah i i remember going i remember school mein uh, so i was not allowed to go and watch movies movies was really something that my father didn't like ha ah. सो इसलिए मेरा कोई स्ट्रॉन्ग मेमोरी मूवीज के साथ है नहीं बहुत बचपन का 
but in school uh, my classmates when i was in maybe 8th or 9th standard or 10th standard they started to go you know bunk school and go for uh, movies and i went on one of those expeditions with them first time hmm. and i think it was a judwa ah salman khan judwa <laughs> and it was such a ride so much fun uh enjoyed the uh, iconic gaane wale uh us film ka music us film ke dance i think karishma kapoor has a major crush on her and salman everybody loved salman in hyderabad uh, he had the biggest fan following in hyderabad yeah yeah and over the years which are the films which have influenced you the most oh uh, i think one one early uh, like to answer your previous question one early strong memory when i was in, maybe in my teens or late teens or whatever वॉज वास्तव 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 ने कुछ किया था आई थिंक माई फ्रेंड वॉज वेरी इंटरेस्टेड इन दैट फिल्म एंड यूज टू डू दो मिमिक्री ऑफ द डायलॉग्स एंड स्टफ दैट गॉट मी इंटरेस्टेड इन द फिल्म कभी कभी ना हमको नहीं पता चलता कोई आजू बाजू वाला कोई ज्यादा इंथू रहेगा राइट एंड इन दैट इज इफ समबडी योर फ्रेंड इज वर्शिपिंग समथिंग देन यू पे अटेंशन टू इट एंड यू फाइंड आउट समथिंग इज देयर सो आई डिस्कवर्ड वास्तव लाइक दैट सो माई फ्रेंड यूज टू जस्ट लाइक वो संजय दत्त के जोन में ही था वो उसकी फिल्म के डायलॉग बोलना ए लेके जा इसको लेके जाने तो डाल देगा मैं इसको एंड ए रमनीकांत भड़वे सब ऑल एवरीथिंग यू नो या ए देख मां पचास तोला ऑल दोस थिंग्स वाज वेरी वेरी इट फेल लाइक अ रियल फिल्म एंड आई हैड नॉट सीन सत्य एंड ऑल आई हाउ दैट लेटर सो आई ग्रो अप नॉट वाचिंग मेनी फिल्म्स आई माय ओह आई हाउ कैन आई फॉरगेट माय अर्ली थिएटर मेमोरीज वाज विद माय फादर so he did not like hindi films much Haan. and did not let us watch hindi films at home ha or any films at home but he used to take us to do theater the jahan par english film chalti thi so he was a big fan of bruce lee jackie chan jet li Haan. i mean i saw i think i don't remember watching bruce lee on big screen but my father used to worship bruce lee and then i started watching when i started watching it was one of the jackie chan films the early jackie chan films and i remember watching indiana jones ah in theater nice i think amrish puri bhi the usme ah <laughs> so those were i think the actioners were my uh, my theater experiences for years yeah before i started going to college and and doing my uh, doing something on my own and this is also reminding me because my father used to watch a lot of rambo movies yeah. when i was chota tha to bas your first movie uh, uh, your first movie memories and movie recommendations come from your father or mother wahi se aata hai and and it so happened after years of me wanting to become an actor and eventually running away from home and landed up in bombay and actually found some work and actually found something to hold on to After years, like maybe two years ago, he gave me a list of uh, one chit. Hindi में उसमें पांच अंग्रेजी uh, फिल्मों के नाम लिखे हैं Ben Hur, Guns of Navarone, oh. Casablanca, Godfather. So I was like, this man knows so much cinema. Ah. I don't know why he he never uh, wanted me to be an actor. I think part of his he must have shut that part of him. You know, हाँ. होता है कभी कभी. I was shocked that he knew he knew all these films. Yeah. Good, bad, ugly. Yeah. Hindi में लिख के दिया उन्होंने. और पता है I also feel proud कभी कभी हम जब family साथ में होते हैं मैं Netflix पे कुछ चलाता हूँ मैं देख रहा हूँ अरे ये तो वो वाली Godfather है ना नहीं Marlon Brando इतना proud feel होता है ना आपको ये सारा पता है? Yeah. I mean we forget the they are the OGs. Yeah. Dad, yeah. Uh, जैसे Zakir बोलता है कि ये भी कभी stud laundry stud laundry थे ये लोग भी. बिल्कुल सही एंड अगर हम अब रिसेंट इयर्स में आए सो विच आर दोज फिल्म इन रिसेंट इयर्स विच हैव इन्फ्लुएंस यू अलॉट आई थिंक सिनेमा मूवीज केम इन ओनली प्रॉबेबली आई आफ्टर आई वेंट टू एफ टी आई दैट्स वेयर आई फिगर कि मेरे को कुछ नहीं बताया यार फिल्मों के बारे में सब लोग बहुत ज़्यादा जानते हैं सिनेमा के बारे में तो वहाँ से मैंने शुरू किया In fact, I have a very nice story. So I went to FTI, and they used to play these uh, world cinema at six o'clock in the evening at the archives or at the main theater in FTI. So huh. our class was over at five o'clock. We would eat something and sit in the archives and sleep. And they would sleep. I mean, all I think fifty percent of all the first year students would just sleep because we can't understand it. Huh. तुम तारकोस के दिखाओगे हमको नहीं समझ में आएगा सो वो सब चल रहा था एंड इट यूज टू बी लाइक कि मेरे अंदर ऐसी क्या कमी है 
कि मैं ये समझ नहीं पा रहा हूँ हाँ। तो ऐसे लगता था और मैं वापस आऊँ और एक्टिंग एक्टिंग स्टूडेंट से बात करूँ इन सब से बात करूँ तो वो लोग ऐसे ऐसे नाम बोलते थे जो मैंने सुने ही नहीं कि मालविन ब्रांडो रॉबर्ट डिनीरो एल्पचिनो या ये या वो तो मुझे कुछ पता ही नहीं था इन सब के बारे में सो वॉट आई स्टार्टेड डूइंग इज आई स्टार्ट गोइंग टू द एफ टी आई डी वी डी लाइब्रेरी एंड स्टार्ट लुकिंग फॉर लाइक द देन सेवेंटीज एटीज नाइन्टीज हॉलीवुड जो इससे नाम पता चल गया अच्छा कौन सी भाई अच्छा रेजिंग बुल रेजिंग बुल हाँ चल रेजिंग बुल देखते हैं तो ढूंढ रहा हूँ कहीं मिल ही नहीं रही है ऐसी फिल्में सो आई स्टार्ट गोइंग टू रेंट रेंटल्स और पूना में मतलब उस टाइम पे अगर हैदराबाद में 20 टू 40 रुपीज सी डी डी वी डी रेंट पर मिल जाती थी पूना वॉज एटी एंड हंड्रेड आई डेंट हैव दैट कैंड ऑफ मनी एट दैट टाइम सो मुझे लगता है इतना महंगा है यार रेंट करके एंड आई डेंट हैव लैपटॉप आई मीन वी वी आर ऑल ट्रिपिंग डी वी डीज एट दैट टाइम आई डेंट हैव एनी ऑफ द रिसोर्स सो वट आई स्टार्ट डूइंग इज देर वॉज अ शॉप इन पूना अ स्मॉल डी वी डी शॉप बट इट वॉज टैक टू द टी मतलब उसका एक कोना ऐसे नहीं है इट लुक्स लाइक अ गीक्स हाउस हर जगह डी वी डी सी डी टैक्ट है He barely had space to sit. This really lanky, old, oldish man, half bald. I I went to him and I told him that he le na eighty hundred rupees. I took it once and I was like, I can't. I don't think it's sustainable model for me. I want to watch more films. So what I started doing is I went to the FTI library and I picked up Am- Amores Peros, which is a incredible film. Have you seen Amores yeah, Peros? Yeah, I have seen it. So Am- Amores Peros, I had seen it. I was like, I was like, I was like, I was like, I'll try my luck. Mm-hmm. So I मैं गया बात करते करते कैजुअली मैंने अमोरस पैर उसका डब्बा रखा और इधर उधर देख रहा तो ही वेंट लाइक दैट ऐसे ये कौन सी है ऐसे दिस इज अ वेरी गुड फिल्म बहुत अच्छी फिल्म है मैंने देखी कल बहुत अच्छी है और ऐसा है और स्पेनिश है और ये है वो तो ही इज लाइक आई सेट यू कैन हैव इट गिव इट टू मी टूमोरो सेट ओके देन आई सेट कैन आई टेक दिस केफ य तो मैंने बाटर शुरू किया उसके साथ तो आई शू टेक वर्ल्ड सिनेमा फ्रॉम टी आई लाइब्रेरी गिव इट टू संपत एंड ही वुड गिव मी पल्प नाइन्टीज सेवेंटीज एटीज मतलब बेनेगल बाबू की फिल्में हो गई नसीर साहब की फिल्में हो गई जो मुझे कहीं नहीं मिल रही थी मैं सब एक एक करके मे बी आई डिड दैट फॉर अयर एंड हाफ कैन आई से समथिंग क्योंकि मेरे को आपकी ये दोनों स्टोरीज आई रिलेट टू दैम और लॉट तो ये जो हमने चैनल चालू किया मैंने फोमो के चक्कर में ही किया था हाँ। मैं बॉम्बे शिफ्ट हो गया इंटर्नशिप करने आता हूँ हाँ। मैं एक पार्टी में एक बार गया था किसी ने एक एक्टर का नाम बोला और सब बात कर रहे हैं और मैंने बोला ये कौन है और पूरा शूट वूट रगड़ सब मेरे को देखने लग गए थे कोई नहीं होता और वो स्टीव कह रहे थे और मेरे को तब नहीं होता था स्टीव कह रहे कौन है नहीं पता और मेरे को इतना बुरा लगा और मैंने कहा देखो वह वो बॉम्बे शिफ्ट होना है तो तेरे को यहाँ की लैंग्वेज तो आनी चाहिए फ्रांस जाएगा तो फ्रेंच आती होगी तो हेल्प ही मिलेगी बॉम्बे जा रहे हैं तो लैंग्वेज तो आनी चाहिए एंड फ्रॉम ट्वेंटी फोर्टीन फिफ्टीन में कॉलेज में था आई स्टार्ट वॉचिंग टू फिल्म डे थ्री फिल्म डे और फिर ये चैनल चालू किया यही हुआ मेरे साथ भी हुआ फोमो कैन बी अ वेरी बिग मोटिवेटर इन लाइफ या इट्स अ ग्रेट फ्यूल जस्ट नॉट नोइंग वॉट अदर्स नो एंड वॉट आर यू मिसिंग ऑन या कि ये नाम सुन रखे थे मैंने कि यार उसने ऐसे कर दिया था उस फिल्म में और उसने ऐसा कुछ कर दिया था उस फिल्म में और आपको पता ही नहीं है और इसमें एक लेयर और ऐड कर दो कि किसी ने आपको ऐसे छोटा दिखा दिया ये नहीं पता हाँ ये भी हुआ था मेरे साथ क्या मैं एक बार किसी दोस्त के रूम पे चला गया था वो लोग सब शाम को आफ्टर क्लास एक एक ड्रिंक लगा रहे थे तो देवर प्लेइंग सम सॉन्ग विच वो बहुत मजे ले रहे थे हाँ। आह वाह वाह ऐसे करके आह वाह वाह क्या बोला ऐसे कौन है कह रहा है कौन है गुलाम अली साहब है ऐसे करके हाँ भाई नहीं पता यार सॉरी गया घर पे मैं फिर समझ में आया कि हंगामा है जो क्यों बरपा मूवीज का बेस्ट पार्ट ही होता है अगर किसी ने ऐसे आपको फील करा देना चुपचाप तीन घंटे निकाल के देख के आ जाओ टाइम कम लगता है ना कि जे देख के आप बोलो क्या बात कर रहे थे बट यू अंडरस्टैंड वाई पीपल Yeah, yeah. Celebrate certain things, you know, yeah, yeah. and you want to be part of the celebration. Yeah. Chal, I have to ask you, which is that film, जो पूरी दुनिया expect करती है कि आपने देखी हो, but आपने आज तक नहीं देखी. Uh, I, ऐसी बहुत सारी है. दिल वाले दो लड़नियाँ ले जाएँगे. हम आप क्या हैं कौन? कोई नहीं देखी थी, because उस time पे देख देखते ही नहीं थे हम लोग घर पे. So I just know clips from those films even now. आपने रील्स में देखी है दिल वाले दिल वाले. हाँ रील्स में देखी है. 
और मैं तो आपका मैं ये देखना चाहता हूँ ये बहुत इंटरेस्टिंग है मेरी भी है मैंने लॉर्ड ऑफ द रिंग्स कभी ढंग से नहीं देखी ढंग से नहीं देखी ढंग से हाँ वो मैंने तीन बार मैराथन किया है तो ओह ऑल लाइक हॉबिट और सारी हाँ सारा सब कुछ और एक्सटेंडेड डायरेक्टर्स कट सब अरे वाह हाँ फैंटेसी आई आई लव दैट जॉन्ड्रा एंड आई थिंक आई लॉर्ड ऑफ द रिंग्स वॉज मैसे फॉर मी इट वॉज सच अ इसलिए गेम ऑफ थ्रोन्स आई वॉज fan of all such stories anywhere they show an intricate lost forgotten empire world fantasy creatures characters i am in i am in those stories i love those stories and bahar ki aisi kaun si film hai jo aapne nahi dekhi classics or the most famous uh, ones i i can only think aise jaise tumne bola i can only think of films i've seen the, the biggest film was titanic and i've seen it <laughs> <laughs> starting se start karte hain nahi nahi no that is great are you also into animated films uh not actively but if i know something is great i'll go watch it like i saw inside out Haan. i saw that one with uh, afterlife Just mexican uh, coco ha uh, celebrated celebration of the dead yes yes coco. coco i enjoyed it i enjoyed all the pixar i think i enjoy, uh, ice age is one of my favorite Haan. i love ice age and nice. shrek have yeah. you seen happy feet happy feet the penguin one yes. i've seen it of course master bahut achhi hai bahut achhi hai it's been a while since i've seen a animated and is it a part of your daily ritual abhi ki time nikal ke hafte mein ek bar koi movie dekh li hai aise uh, i would like to say yes but it's not happening uh, earlier uh, when i was uh, relatively free or i had some it's been a bit hectic last uh, especially uh, since i've been for last one year i've been working back to back maine is saal mein teen filme shoot kar raha hu ah so there's literally like every time i get no every thoda bhi agar 2 ghante bhi mil raha i'm trying to like do something that takes me away from films you know yeah. so it's been uh, difficult to watch i think i last i saw was jubilee uh, which i thoroughly enjoyed and i enjoyed jee karta also nice so ye do maine dekhi let's talk about like these shows also now ki shows mein which are your favorite shows of all time all time hmm. okay so i think uh, the nick Oh nice Nick ki koi baat nahi karta Ha Nick is god level for me Oh Ha if if anybody ever has to make a show about any field set in a certain time it's a matlab research backed it's motherfucking great show Fuck Nick have you seen it I have seen uh, cancel ho gaya tha wo ek do season ke baad do hi season Ha 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 do ke baad Soda bak mit nahi banaya usne Ha So Nick is fab. I enjoyed uh, I May Destroy You. I love I May on, Destroy uh, You on on Hotstar. I enjoyed another, but this is not something that I feel like it's it's for everybody. But there's a show called I Know This Much Is True. Oh, आप मेरी list बोल रहे हो पूरी की पूरी list है ये मेरे ये तीनों के तीनों. अच्छा नहीं और भी है. हाँ हाँ नहीं go on. But I Know This Much Is True is heartbreaking. Like Macrofen. to next level. तो अगर आप नहीं बर्दाश्त कर सकते ब्लीकनेस तो प्लीज अवॉइड दैट शो बट इट इज इट्स आई कॉन्ट रिविजिट दैट शो आई कॉन्ट वॉच इट एवर अगेन बट इट जस्ट डिड अ लॉट टू मी वेन आई सो इट एंड ऑफकोर्स देर आर शोज लाइक टेड लैसो एंड ब्रेकिंग बैड एंड गेम ऑफ थ्रोन्स एंड आई वॉज अ बिग फ्रेंड्स गाय ऑल्सो नेवर एक्टिवली लाइक वो डी वी डी आने के बाद फ्रेंड्स देखना शुरू किया था I want to talk about like uh, I may destroy to you. मेरे को ऐसा लगता है कि um, sexual abuse के topic में मैं जितना उस show से सीखा हूँ, जो intricacies होती हैं, जो I, कोई... and very uh, contemporary, very uh-huh. modern, today's uh, angst, today's, today's stories, angst. today's lack of any kind of hope and despair, like yeah. it's just uh, but treated again. I think I was enjoying Fleabag too much, and somebody said कि Oh, euphoria, and said this is the real deal. Like euphoria is very celebrated and stuff, but if you watch I May Destroy You, it is pretty much the same universe of young adults trying to figure out their lives, but it's done in a very, मतलब उसके अंदर contamination नहीं है ज़्यादा. Very true. बहुत. Very true. It's naked. It's like stark and naked and on the face. Or I know this much is true. जो Mark Ruffalo वाला है. There is a scene in that. जब वो फ्यूनरल पे फादर को डे रिमेंबर 
लाइक ही लेट्स गो अगे तो तुम्हारी वजह से दीप ब्रदर वाज लाइक वो कभी बन आई जस्ट रिमेंबर लाइक वो एक इमेजरी है मेरे को लगता है आपको ना कोई भी चीज 5 या 10 परसेंट याद रहती है जब खत्म हो जाती है और वो इमेजेस रह जाती है या आई जस्ट इट जस्ट ब्रोक मी एंड आई केप्ट आई केप्ट क्राइंग थ्रू द शो एंड आई फेल्ट द पेन आई फेल लाइक ओ माय गॉड हाउ लो कितना बुरा एक इंसान के साथ हो सकता है और and it's relentless it keeps getting you know more and more painful for this person for both the brothers and yeah. their life and uh, i feel like mark ruffalo is probably the greatest actor we have right now we've lost philip simmer hoffman who was also incredible i love philip simmer hoffman yeah which are your some of your favorite philip simmer hoffman performances kapote uh, is iconic cuz we've seen this man in so many different shades but kapote was a completely different flair that their performance is out of the world i enjoyed him in smaller parts he keeps coming and doing yes. his things you know yes money ball mein aaye the ek chota sa role tha yeah and uh, he is a great actor in scent of a woman he's he's incredible in uh, uh, what was that film have you seen boogie nights yes yes i have i've seen all he's playing the continuity yes. continuity guy <laughs> in a porn <laughs> movie <laughs> yeah he's like like visibly gay ha a uh, continuity guy in a porn movie set yeah what a character <laughs> in fact in mission impossible also one of the opening scenes na wo jo gun rakhi hoti hai yeah. i think it's mi3 jahan pe philip seymour hoffman is the villain like that's also very amazing mainly mi ekdam se aise ho gayi thi yeah. so, philip seymour no he would he, he would and there's a film called 21 24th 25th hour uh it. edward norton spike lee ki uh, spike lee ki film you have to watch him so his character is somebody who is like a teacher in a in a um um in a high school yeah. kind of a place and uh, uh, somebody who is not very confident about himself is struggling with the opposite sex and yeah. all these things uh are shown in the moment you see him yeah. you know uh and his character had a very interesting a uh, description uh, in in the story you will figure out ki you know one of the friend just gives a rude remark to uh, hoffman's character saying your breath smells and when you watch the film you you actually can feel like this person does not have a sense of hygiene you know uh, like it's so layered the performance that you can tell like and feel it बहुत ज्यादा इम्प्रेस्ड हूँ लाइक रहा था मैं अभी भी जब भी उनका बर्थडे होता है ना मैं एक फोटो डालता हूँ फिलिप सी और उनकी एक पिक्चर है अनहैप्पीनेस यानेस विद्रेट उसकी भी कम बात हुई है बट लाइक दैट मेरे को याद है पंकज त्रिपाठी ने किसी इंटरव्यू में बोला था कि बड़े रोल्स में तो मजा आता है छोटे में मजा आता है जहाँ पे आपको एक बॉल में आके सिक्सर मारना होता है क्या सही लाइन है ना वो बहुत मजा आता है एंड फिलिप सीमोर ऑफमैन का हर छोटे रोल में हुए आपको याद रह जाता है वो कौन आया था हाँ यू वुड नेवर बी एबल टू टेल विच इज दैट फिलिप सीमोर ऑफमैन फिल्म दैट बट यू वुड रिमेम्बर यू वुड यू वुड ही वुड मेक एन इम्पैक्ट इन एवरी थिंग दैट ही अपियर्ड ऑन ही वॉज वेरी वेरी इनफैक्ट इरफान वन ऑफ इरफान फेवरेट एक्टर वॉज फिलिप सीमोर ऑफमैन टोल्ड मी वेन यू मेट एंड शोज की हम बातें कर रहे थे एंड यू टोल्ड मी ऑल ऑफ दी शो हम ये पार्ट हमेशा काटना चालू करेंगे बिकॉज आई टेल इट टू ऑल द गेस्ट आई हैवन टोल्ड यू शायद बेटर गोल्स हॉल के जो क्रिएटर है ना दो क्रिएटर्स हैं पीटर गोल्ड एंड वेंस के लेवन सो हमारे हंड्रेड एपिसोड में आई डेड एन एपिसोड विद पीटर गोल्ड यू डिड एन एपिसोड विद मैंने ट्विटर पे उनको अप्रोच किया था एंड लाइक जूम पे हुआ था कोविड के टाइम पे बॉस दैट बिग और प्लेटिनम लेवल प्लेटिनम लेवल और सेम जैसे हम बात करें रिकमेंडेशन रिकमेंडेशन रिकमेंड दिस थिंग अबाउट हिज फेवरेट ओपनिंग क्रेडिट्स कि फिल्मों में आप देखो ना कि आप जैसे याद रह जाते हो जैसे स्कैम 92 के ओपनिंग क्रेडिट्स हैं द क्रेडिट्स ऑफ द सॉन्ग द क्रेडिट्स द एनिमेशन ऑफ इट द वे दे तो उन्होंने एक दो बहुत पुराने मेरे को शोज बताए यू मेरे को याद नहीं कि आई यू वुडंट रिमेंबर दोस बट लाइक दिस इज वेयर इट ऑल स्टार्टेड फ्रॉम एंड दे इंटेंशनली मेड अ बैड ओपनिंग क्रेडिट फॉर बेटर कॉल सॉल उन्होंने ये बताया कि हम राइटर्स रूम में थे कि सब चार सब अच्छे बना रहे तो हमने सोचा लेट्स मेक अ बैड ओपनिंग क्रेडिट तो चार सेकंड आता है ग्लिच इफेक्ट के साथ ब्यूटीफुल आई लव सच कॉल्स आई लव इट व्हेन क्रिएटर्स गोले की ये कर देते हैं एंड इट 
एंड बिकॉज इतना बेजार आइडिया होता है या इतना मतलब बिकॉज वी वी नो कि ये खराब आइडिया है कि अच्छा तो होना ही चाहिए बट yeah. नहीं अच्छा नहीं होगा तो भी बहुत अच्छा है स्टोरी लाइक दिस जो एन जो एनसन एक लाइक उनकी डेथ हो गई एक म्यूजिक कंपोजर है जिन्होंने अराइवल मूवी का साउंड ट्रैक किया था तो एक पिक्चर आई थी मदर जेनिफर लॉरेंस वाली आई डेंट लाइक इट हाँ मेरे को भी पसंद नहीं आया बट उन्होंने उस पूरी पिक्चर का साउंड ट्रैक दिया था एंड आज अब पूरी मूवी रेडी हो गई ही वेंट टू द डायरेक्टर एंड ही सेट शायद डेरन आर एनॉस्के के शायद एंड ही वेंट टू द डायरेक्टर एंड ही सेट की यू नो वॉट आई डोंट थिंक इस पिक्चर में साउंड ट्रैक होना चाहिए Okay. पूरा साउंड ट्रैक बनाने के बाद ही सेट मेरा साउंड ट्रैक हटा था एंड देन एंड देर इज नो साउंड ट्रैक ऑफ जॉन एंड ये क्या मतलब दिस इज द अल्टीमेट सरेंडर टू आर्ट वाओ ऐसे कौन करते हैं यार कि जो मैंने किया ना हटा दो ये ये सीन हटा दो ये कर दो ये बैठ नहीं रहा आई हैव हर्ड स्टोरीज लाइक दिस समबडी वाज टेलिंग मी कि देयर इज अ देयर इज अ सीक्वेंस वेयर आई एम फॉरगेटिंग हु दिस स्टोरी इज फॉर बट देर अ सीक्वेंस इन शिवा जब लड़के चेन में निकाल के झगड़ा करने लग जाते हैं कॉलेज बॉयज आर फाइटिंग विद इच अदर हाँ एंड द डायरेक्टर वॉन्टेड अ सर्टन काइंड ऑफ म्यूजिक एंड दिस म्यूजिक डायरेक्टर वाइट एंड सेड गिव अ वेरी लाइक सैड ऑलमोस्ट लाइक अ लल बाय फील टू इट हाँ लोरी की तरह एक सैड हाँ पीस दिया है ऐसे सुना है मैंने uh and somebody asked him ki why are you giving this kind of a music in this scene he's like uh, college kids are fighting and they should be studying and i feel bad and their mothers will feel bad uh. and it's like a you know ki kitna pure jagah se aa sakta hai na cheez ek to hota hai ki ye chalega ek hota hai ki yaar nahi ye galat hai ye matlab kisi ka dil dukh raha hai ye dekh yeah yeah and i was like yeah. wow These stories always stay with you. Yeah. जब आपको पता चलता है wow. Amazing, amazing. मैं आपसे और लाइक लाइक लेट्स ब्रॉड इन दिस पैलेट एंड लेट्स नाउ मूव टू मूवीज और शोज में हम कभी भी वापस आ सकते हैं अगर आपको कोई बात याद आ जाए बट अब मैं आपसे किताबों की भी बातें करना चाहता हूँ वॉट्स योर रिलेशनशिप विद बुक्स आई थिंक इट स्टार्टेड वेरी अर्ली ऑन विद कॉमिक बुक्स इन वन ऑफ माई सब आई यूज टू रीड डायमंड कॉमिक्स बट आई वॉज नॉट क्रेजी अबाउट इट आई वॉज इंजॉइंग इट टिंकल अमर चित्र कथा in diamond comics um raj uh, chacha choudhary and but it, that was available in hyderabad um but when i went for a summer vacation in rajasthan my mother's place uh, my nani ke ghar pe kishangarh ha kishangarh so udhar bahut hindi uh, comics ka bahut chalan tha hmm. uh to wahan par maybe i picked up my first nagraj ah. or super commando dru comics and then maybe for next 15 years i was just doing that uh, maybe 15 18 years yeah. so i was so invested in comic books uh, from comic books i think i moved to video games but it was just like the only like i was obsessed about it wow uh maine phir kharidna shuru kiya scrap shop se kawadi ke paas se cuz it was not available in shops in rajasthan in in hyderabad and my only source was to get it from rajasthan every time i go once a year so i used to read four or five a day so you are four a day and then before leaving i'll buy maybe 10 15 comics which, huh. which i could afford and then aise kar kar ke over the next 15 18 years mera kuch 500 comics ka collection ho gaya wow. tha khud ka aur mere ko aise chahiye tha ki wo pehli kramang se leke aaj tak ki jitni bhi aayi hai super commando do ki mujhe sari chahiye wow so new ones are available old ones are available in some rent shops but there are some which are not available anywhere for those i used to go walk around uh, hyderabad there's a second uh, there's a second hand book market in abids in hyderabad wo ek street hoti hai sunday morning wahan par kabadi uh, purane uh, book book Uh, book sellers अपने बुक्स ऐसे स्ट्रीट पेवमेंट पे फुटपाथ पे लगा देते हैं एंड हुआ वॉन्ट्स टू वॉक अराउंड एंड पिक वट एवर दे वा तो आई स्टार्ट गोइंग दे माई फादर इज टू गो दे टू बाई बुक्स ऑन एंटीक्स बिकॉज ही ही वॉज वेरी इंटरेस्टेड इन एंटीक्स सो विद हिम वेन आई वेंट एंड आई फाउंड अरे यार यहाँ पर तो नागराज और सुपर सुपर कमांडो दुर्ग की स्पेशल एडिशन बुक मिल गई मुझे यू नो सो then i started doing this on my own so i started to kind of scout for all the places where i could find comic books in hyderabad do you hindi comic books by any chance do you still have any of these comics so i have a bit of a tragic story with this so when i ran away from home 
at the age of what 21 and I was uh, collecting till then I ran away from home and uh, and I heard ki he's uh, sold it to a kabadi after I left so I didn't have anything to do because I had new interest in life and new, new life had started but I remember watching Tare Zameen and on Tare Zameen I saw and I just realized that you know that that was so nasty to sell my comic books and I was crying in the screening the film was finished and everyone was going I didn't get up there and people didn't understand what was going on and I said to my friend I said no I sent my comic books to my father shit sure. <laughs> It's painful. It's very painful. I remember how they felt, how they smelled. I used to put a tape on their And I used to remember the name of all uh, Super Commander Guru books in order. Like um, Pratishot Ki Jwala, Roman Hathiara, Adam Khoro Ka Swark, Swark Ki Tabai, Ruhon Ka Shikhanja, Lahu Ke Piyase. So I used to have 28 jamaa ki thi. Uski jitni bhi thi. Uh, this is just one of them. I had Doga, Bhedia, Parmanu, uh, Nagaraj. So, now, as you comic books were going on, but uh, which is the oldest antique piece that you own right now? Which is just now sacred to you, a child's childhood piece that you have with you right now? I'm sure I have a few things. Which you keep like uh, with you or something, is that something? So, the thing is, it got upcycled or recycled. So, I had a video game, Media. Uh, 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 Nintendo, ka jo bhi hai, which got uh, given to my nieces and nephews, so which second generation, third generation, tak gaya hai wo. so Hyderabad, there are a lot of things here, maybe some, some small things here and there, but I don't remember much of it. Are you big on nostalgia? Like, what's your opinion on nostalgia? No, I don't know. What does it mean? Move on and Haan, move on. Very nice. No looking back. Lovely, lovely, lovely. And like in recent times, are there any books that like uh, you have read that you would like to recommend? So that, that was my beginning with uh, books. Haan. And then when I went to FTI, I realized that again, I don't know literature. In uh, Hyderabad, mein jo theater kiya tha, usme bhi literature ki zarurat nahi thi. Wo, am, am boli chali mein tha, Hyderabadi boli mein tha. Uh, so I think my first introduction happened uh, right at the fag end of my FTI. Of course, I was to read plays and perform plays, but that's again not actively uh, in, involved in reading. But I think I just came to Bombay for one audition and I stayed at a friend's place. And I had some time to kill, so I didn't read it. The last cover of last cover, I read one sentence, one paragraph. That was Manto's book. It said that if in this society, अगर आपको मेरी कहानी नहीं अच्छी लगती तो आपको समाज नहीं अच्छा लगता है ऐसा नहीं है कि मेरी कहानी कहानी खराब है या डाक है मैं समाज को जैसा है वैसा दिखाता हूँ अगर आपको मेरी कहानियों से तकलीफ होती तो आपको समाज से तकलीफ होनी चाहिए उस तरह का सम बेस सिंपल थिंग्स रिटन एंड आई वाज लाइक हु uh, on a piece of paper, written stuff is uh, for me is Manto, hands down. And then I got into short story. So I then figured that Manto ka maine dastavez pad liya hai. Then I, uh, I used to actively go and watch uh, Nasir Saab perform at Prithvi. He, he played a lot of Manto stories and Prem Chand. And then I figured out ki ye kar rahe hai, to chalo isma tapa pad lete hai, Manto pad lete hai, Prem Chand pad lete hai, Gulzar Saab pad lete hai. Then I started wow. reading more, I started reading Goldal, Ruskin Bond. Anybody with short stories because I didn't have uh, a great uh, temperament for, for long huh. uh, novels. I think the first I read was Da Vinci Code and I was blown by again the same uh, fantasy, history, twisted, all this. Because Da Vinci Code had everything. Yeah, yeah. It was a great thriller. Uh, and one of the early influences book wise was Chaplin's document, uh, biography, sorry, autobiography. Who? Chaplin's. Chaplin's autobiography. Hmm. I read it twice. It just showed the journey of this man who hadn't been to a school for a day huh. and who learned one day, yeah. uh, one word a day and yeah. wrote such a rich yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. book with such rich, rich vocabulary yeah. and, and what an incredible life. I think I read Anupama Chopra Shole also. Oh yes. The Making. Yeah. Yeah. Have you read that book? No, no, no. I know about That was my introduction to the passion that it takes to make movies and yeah. how crazy it is. Yeah. Uh, before I even did anything about acting or, or movies. 
so i read that i was like what is this ha uh, the stories are endless and fascinating ha have you also read scripts of the films you love i say koi aapko no i tried doing it in the lockdown it didn't work out well for me because i just felt like once you've seen the films then Haan. no the script doesn't do much and uh, i don't know does it help matlab maine maine ek bar ye khud bhi try kiya tha maine moonlight jo Haan. film hai na uski script aa gayi thi ek time pe after the movie came out maine pehle dekhi thi lekin maine pehle first like sorry first i read the script oh. and then i went to ha that could be an interesting exercise but uh, wo hota nahi hai Haan. it's not easy to get a get hold of a film that you love first of all you have to love the film yes मेरे को ये बहुत इंटरेस्टिंग लगता है कि आई गेट अ लॉट ऑफ लाइक स्लैक फॉर आस्किंग दीज क्वेश्चन क्योंकि मैं इमेज जब आप कोई किताब पढ़ते हो तो आप एक इमेज इमेजिन कर लेते हो राइट right? कि ये इंसान ऐसा दिखता है बट फिर ऑथर ने ज़्यादा डिस्क्राइब कर दिया hmm. और वो बोलते हैं वो ऐसा दिखता है बट समटाइम्स आई होल्ड ऑन टू द इमेज जो मैंने बना ली एंड मैं पूरी किताब ना ऐसे करता हूँ कि नहीं मैंने ये इमेजिन कर लिया है Now I don't want how you want me to think of. When you're watching the film, na? Even while reading books. Oh. कहाँ क्यों ही किताब पढ़ रहे हो और वो बता रहे हैं कि जो हमारा villain है ये ऐसा दिखता है ऐसा दिखता है. नहीं but मैंने एक phase दे दिया. हाँ. You know because. Uh, but it keeps changing, no? Yeah. Like I was reading uh, Palace of Illusions re- recently. Uh, it's a Mahabharat take yeah. uh, through Draupadi's eyes. हाँ. Very interesting. Yeah. So what happened is, of course, we remember the Draupadi we saw yeah. as a little boy. Yeah. Uh, but that image gets taken away because things keep happening, and you get keep getting inside the character's mind. True. And every time she does something that you don't expect her to do, then you she changes. Yes. Yes. She yes. changes form. Yes. And uh, yeah, it's I enjoy reading as an active uh, because it's it's very participatory. It requires more of your participation than watching a film this i remember we asked this to some of our earlier guests ki agar aap murakami pad rahe ho bahar ki kisi author ko pad rahe ho so aapke dimag mein jo faces aa rahe hain are they japanese faces or are they the faces Haan. from your memories ya aapke around jo wow yeah i read, I read that kafka by the sh- ha kafka on the shore uh but i kept getting video game characters because <laughs> <laughs> i was playing in that video game uh, iconic video game where you have to take uh, the choices um you're playing a detective they're playing three characters Ach- it's a very uh, ahead of the time video game that came out i don't remember the name now okay. full barish barish new york you're playing one detective one something one girl and interrogations are happening so wo detective mere dimag mein baith gaya tha overcoat big stout guy so i kept seeing that guy i don't know why because there's a there's a Guy like that in yeah, Kafka yeah. by the shore, right? Yeah. So, how? But he's very interesting. Like that. Now you have mentioned video games quite a lot of times. So huh. I want to know video game recommendations. Kya hai? Oh, aap? nice. <laughs> so my journey started in 1999, I think. Two things happened around that. I mean, after 96, 97, me, I came out. I used to play Mario and all. But hardcore video game happened when PlayStation One. Ah. Pe hand laga tha. So I think I started with Tekken. Oh, that nice. was the first game. Tekken One. Tekken one or Tekken two? Got it. वहाँ से शुरू हुआ था. Hmm. So बीच में I had brief phase of playing snooker a lot. I used to just go and play hmm. pool or snooker all day. But that got broken with video games. Uh, Tekken में which was your favorite player? My favorite was Lee Woo Long and Martial Law. Haan. I was a big again grew up with Bruce Lee and Jackie Haan. Chan kind of Haan. heroes, right? So anybody with kung fu abilities. Nice. I didn't like kickboxers or I didn't like the boxers or the judo or the, the kings. No, no. I need somebody to. Oh, nice. वो चाहिए थोड़ा सा. मेरे को एडी पसंद है जो डांस करता है. Eddie was again. Eddie came थोड़ा आगे नो. हाँ. So by then I was. I had enough. I had enough fun with uh, Lee Woo Long and nice. Martial Law. When Eddie came, it was fun. Eddie and his her, his sister. Ha ha ha. Both were fascinating characters. So Tekken uh, se start hua. Tekken se shuru hua tha, and uh, then uh, a lot of boys. I used to play. Ye rent shop mein. You go and ah, play yes, and pay yes, money for the yes, yes. for an hour. So I used to play uh, either Tekken or wrestling with my friend. And there used to be. Uh, bunch of five six boys on one television playing one person is playing and five are just watching <laughs> that kind of a game and we never liked those boys like ye kaisa game khelte hai log then i figured out ki these guys are playing this game with so much intent and passion what it is then i found out it's tomb raider 
Ah. And that was a game changer for me. I didn't start with Tomb Raider, but I, one time I got my hands on Silent Hill. This is a game called Silent Hill, Japanese, um, uh, Japanese creator um, and American collaboration. And that mm-hmm. guy is basically, wo, matlab if if video game had Rahman, he's Rahman of video oh. games. Haan. So he's that guy. Ki matlab god level. So this guy knew how to make horror. So Silent Hill is a horror game. And Silent Hill 1 and 2 are right now, if you look at the history of gaming, nothing comes close to them in terms of storytelling and horror. Like Last of Us, I have nothing on it. Like they are all inspired by Silent Hill. The Last of Us, you say is better. Yes, this is, this is basically, this is where it started. Haan. This is where they push boundaries in terms of video gaming. With Silent Hill. Resident Evil came slightly Haan. later on. So I was heavily into survival horror genre. Haan. Then I was into fantasy and adventure genre. So right now I'm playing Ghost of Tsushima, which is again, oh, lovely. what a lovely game. I finished the game. Uh, I I spent I did an all nighter and I finished the game uh, two days ago. Wow! Uh, it took me like a month and a half in between shoots and this and that. Wow! So my my game recommendations are I definitely play Silent Hill. Uh, I, the old ones are very dated, so find the new one and play it. Resident Evil is is a great franchise again. The new uh, Resident Evil Four remastered version is also fab. Last of Us is 10 on 10. It's the best game. Which one do you like? One one or two? One. Hmm. One is hands down the most immersive gaming, uh, modern day gaming ever. Hmm. And I've never felt like I'm so connected to any character in a video game before this. You feel like you want to protect this child, which happened in the show. How did the show the show was just like memory, uh, like a nostalgia of the game. Because ah. when you play the game, boss, you, you've gone through the journey. <laughs> show, show can only, yeah, show can do only this much. Yeah. But if you played the game, it's like Harry Potter books with Harry, Harry Potter films, you know, or any. Uh, uh, so, and video gaming is the most immersive form, right? It takes everything from you. Yeah. And it requires your participation more than any other form. Yeah. So, yeah, that's great. And, uh, uh, there was game in the Uncharted series. Ah, nice. Fab. Nice. Nice. Kabhi aapka ye Counter-Strike wala phase hai? Nahin. So, I was not into FPS. crazy shooting. I, I like exploration more ah. in gaming than uh, like finding out what is behind that door. Wow. Uh, so Silent Hill that did very well with that. Ah. So it had a map, but a, not a clear map. It starts to open up as you go along. Hmm. And there are clues which are so difficult. Ah. So Japanese people, they knew how to Main how to a game. Recommend ah. uh, it's called Gris. G-R-I-S. It's a 2D game. Ah. Uh, se Mario se wo hai, but it's one of the most aesthetic things I've ever seen in mm. my life. Ek, uh, ladki ko hai who is in depression. And pura, matlab, it's like uh, aesthetic porn. Yeah. Ki, like, she has to reach somewhere and she has some powers. Or andhera or hai. And she depression mein aur deep jaye wow. jaye hai. So it at like like subplot level, uska depression ke baare mein ye baat hai. But dekhoge, it's dunia ka sabse acha music baj raha hai peacock sari andhera ho raha hai chand nikal ke aa raha hai i'll show it to you jaise hamara ek khatam hoga na aapko main ek aadhi image dikhaunga wow. iski beautiful stuff i am not ps pe for mm-hmm. ye this is for laptop or steam pe ya aapko mil jayega pc pe okay pe. you should definitely try it yeah so i'm definitely uh, bookmarking this haan. i want to play a, a good go one cuz i just finished ghost of tsushima and i'm feeling like i don't have any more purpose in life. Ghost of Tsushima, my friend in Bombay, my friend is again, he's a filmmaker, he showed it to me. It was cinema. Tha. cinema. Go, it is cinema. They are, they are, they are that cinematic that a filter render mode laga diya unhone jiska naam hai Kurosawa. Hmm. Kurosawa mode. Ha, Kurosawa you, mode. You yes, switch yes. to that mode and <laughs> the audio goes 8 bit, 8 bit and the images become black and white yes. and grainy. And film glitches and the film burns. Everything. It's oh, yeah, there was like a bhi dikh rahi thi na. <laughs> what a game. Oh, yeah. what a game. 
आई हैड नो क्लू हमारा इतना मस्त आई डेंट नो यू वर इन टू वीडियो गेम्स इतना स्विच वो जो होती है नहीं नेवर गॉट इन टू द वी आर येट बट पी एस वी आर टू इज लॉन्च और जस्ट अबाउट टू लॉन्च और समथिंग लाइक दैट सो फ्रेंड ऑफ माइंड इज इन यू एस यू एस सो आई एम ट्राइंग टू गेट टू सी इफ आई कैन गेट बिकॉज हॉर इन वी आर इज गोइंग टू बी प्रोबेबली नीड टू मोनिटर माई हार्ट बट आई वॉन्ट टू डू इट फोन में कोई गेम्स है जो आप खेलते हैं नहीं फोन पे आई डोंट की बिकॉज इज द वर्स्ट थिंग यू कैन डू या How is your phone hygiene like? Like Insta वगैरह under control है कितना use करना है जब थोड़ा out of control हो जाता है just, I just take a break for थ्री to फाइव days. And I just delete well, the app. And you don't download it again or anything? No, I decided कि अभी तीन दिन तक कुछ post नहीं कर रहा है I can take this break. But releases के time पर नहीं हो पाता है वो It's the worst time. And so, do you get stuck on those reels का doom loop? So चले? I don't ever press the reels वाला I have never done ये सिखा दो कैसे करते बिकॉज मुझे पता ही नहीं था रील्स क्या है सो आई आई नेवर गॉड इन टू इट आई एम नॉट अ रील्स पर्सन सो दैट पार्ट ऑफ दैट पार्ट ऑफ द स्क्रीन इज नेवर यूटिलाइज वाह सो या आई जस्ट गो टू द एक्सप्लोर लाइक माई फीड लाइक वट एवर शोज अप इन दैन आई गेट वेरी टायर्ड वेरी इजिली बट माई ऑब्सेशन हैज बीन स्नीकर्स एंड वॉचेज एंड एंड सच थिंग सो दोज आर something that i can spend a lot of hours yeah i was watching stupid things and i i i think i watched everything about rolex in the last week wow. i saw so much about it i read so much about it i know so many models now it gets too much i think i'm obsessive so i try to kind of not get into things so i have seen a couple of videos jahan pe aapne sneakers ki baat baat ki hai watches ka aap mereko batao ye and if someone want, wants to get into this like uh, uh, like deep dive into watches kahan se start kare jaise so it started with me uh, uh, as a kid only but it wasn't into fancy watch it was about what looks good on my wrist um, but somewhere in 2015 16 I was shooting for something. They gave me a watch, HMT watch, and I fell in love with the watch. Then I figured out this is chabi bharna padta hai. So just the idea that this is an old watch, it's mechanical. Oh, you have to hand wound it wow. for it to run, and it has a reserve for like thirty hours, twenty four hours. Ki baad mein fir se bharna padega. Um, so I started playing with the watch a little bit, and then I found out there is a model called HMT Vijay, which came out. ओके सो आई वाज लाइक मेरे नाम की वॉच है मुझे तो चाहिए बट दिस नॉट मेड एनी मोर देन आई वेंट टू देयर वेबसाइट एंड गुलशन टोल में कि किसी किसी दिन आ जाती है एक सो आई केप गोइंग टू द वेबसाइट देन आई स्टार्टेड चेकिंग ई बे एंड स्टफ लाइक आई केप फाइंडिंग वन वॉच ऑफ द अदर सो आई स्टार्टेड बाइंग एच एम टी वॉचेज बिकॉज आई कूंट गेट एच एम टी विज आई स्टार्ट बाइंग अदर एच एम टी वॉचेज देन एट वन पॉइंट आई हैड I probably have like five or six HMT widgets of all kind, different ah. kinds. So that's how it started. Like, oh, chabi bharna, oh, sab karna. You know, the, you you open the watch up, you see the mechanism. Wow. It's like uh, we have access to kitna mera calorie burn ho raha hai huh. phone mein, but just the just the fact that this watch doesn't do any of this, and it just shows you time. is very nice <laughs> i like the simplicity of it lovely ki ye ghadi kuch nahi karti hai isme kuch purze hain wo is tarah se design kiye gaye hain ki agar aap isme chabi bhar doge to ye chalegi aur nahi to nahi chalegi aur ye giregi to kharab ho jayegi pani mein nahi dal sakte bahut sari cheez hai iphone ko aap kahin par bhi le jao pani mein andar chala jata can do everything but this thing just shows time if you take care of it ha and i feel like that's that's like very I don't know. Point. Point. <laughs> <laughs> so that's how it started, and then uh, so that's how I got into mechanical watches. So I am I don't enjoy the digital watches. I have the iPhone watch. I have the Apple watch. I have everything. I have the quartz watches also, the battery uh, operated watches. But something about just either. So then I figured out that hand is not. And there are watches which are self winding basically with Achla? movement, like this watch that I'm wearing. Ha. अगर मैं चलते फिरते रहूंगा तो ये चाबी भरती रहेगी इसमें या दिस इज माय लेटेस्ट इट्स अ इट्स अ वेरी डिफिकल्ट टू गेट वॉच मैं इसका क्लोज अप शॉट लेता हूँ इससे बेसिकली दिस इज इट हैज अ डायल इन इट अ डायल इन इट 
इट हैज अट वेट एंड जस्ट मूव सो इफ आई मूव लाइक दिस नो इट द मैकेनिज्म सच की चाबी भर जाएगी उसके अंदर सो इफ यू वेयर इट इट शोस टाइम इफ यू डोंट वेयर इट इट विल स्टॉप शोइंग टाइम लवली लवली एंड कोई YouTube चैनल्स वगैरह हैं जो हम देख सकते हैं जिन मगल्स जिनको नहीं पता है ये वॉचेस की दुनिया कैसे मैं एंड पॉइंट क्या हो सकता है दिस इज फेयरली रीसेंट फॉर मी आई मीन ऑब्सेसिवली लुकिंग एट रोलेक्स इज बिग आल्सो बिकॉज़ इट्स सो हाइट दैट यू कांट गेट योर हैंड्स ऑन इट इवन इफ यू गो टू द सेलर कि मेरे पास पैसे हैं वो नहीं देंगे आपको क्योंकि वेट लिस्ट है सो सो दैट क्रिएट्स क्यूरियोसिटी कि तो आई थिंक इफ यू जस्ट लुक फॉर इट आई एम श्योर देर आर पीपल हु विल राइट इन द कॉमेंट्स हु आर द पीपल हू फॉलो बट आई 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 जस्ट लाइक वट एवर प्लेड नेक्स्ट आई वेंट विद इट फॉर मे बी अ वीक दिस इज लवली अभी मैं सक्सेशन देख रहा था मैं उसके थ्रू वॉचेस में घुस रहा था क्योंकि कैंडल रॉय ने कुछ एक दो बहुत महंगी उसमें वॉचेस पहनी थी ये एफ वन के ड्राइवर्स भी आई कॉन्ट रिमेम्बर द नेम ऑफ इट वो कुछ तीन चार करोड़ रुपए की एक वॉच आती है वो भी मैकेनिकल वॉच है so that is how i was trying to get into the watches thing. yeah it's a fascinating world yeah and it's a very like only people who are in that world will, will know abhi matlab it's like a very small club but people who are in that club they'll know they'll kya pehna hai yeah now one of the final segments mai ko aapse music ki baat karne music ke sath aapka kaisa rishta hai music ke sath uh, yaar music ke sath again the same uh, issue started <laughs> at home Because it wasn't really encouraged to kind of play music and huh. and be like that. But I remember first early memories were a lot of Michael Jackson songs. Ah. I think uh, we had a cassette of Bad, hmm. Michael Jackson Bad, which we had listened to all the time. So I think I've been listening to the same song for twenty years. No, no, I have, I have uh, some songs that I probably uh, started listening to when I was eighteen, nineteen. या वो एम पी थ्री प्लेयर जब भी आया होगा वो मैंने एक फोल्डर बनाया हुआ वो फोल्डर मैंने जो भी फोन चेंज किया उसमें आ गया अभी वो एपल लाइब्रेरी में मेरा अपलोडेड है ऑलरेडी सो आई बिन लिसनिंग टू दोस्ट हंड्रेड एंड फिफ्टी टू हंड्रेड सॉन्ग फॉर ट्वेंटी ईयर्स आई कीप एडिंग वन और टू लाइक आई कीप शिजैमिंग वेर एवर आई गो बट या इट्स आई गॉट इन टू म्यूजिक पैशनेटली थ्रू हिप हॉप एंड आई थिंक एम एन एम वॉज द फर्स्ट person to kind of grab my collar and say ki sun mere ko because he was, he was I, i i don't know how it connected uh, to me i used to go to internet cafes and search for a song and get the lyrics and print them out <laughs> and listen to him while i'm trying to understand what he's saying you know it was that bad oh. but i just got sucked into his music wow. and that was the beginning of like obsession with eminem Wow. and and then that turned into obsession into like a, a real uh, fan of hip hop music uh so i follow hip hop music as much as i can and then uh, i'm a big fan of nusrat fateh ali khan so if i'm ever in like thinking ki kya sunu kya nahi i just play and i play the longest one kyunki wo pehla 5 7 minute to wo garam ho rahe hain so you know so it's next level the gorakhanda is 45 minutes ah you know So it's like if you want to lose yourself to music, there's nobody better than Nusrat Fateh Ali Khan. Nusrat Fateh Ali Khan, sir. Yeah. And uh, yeah, I I I listen to a. I feel like it's it does something to the day. Like if I feel like uh, if I'm feeling a little you know under the uh, pressure or if I'm feeling low, then I play a certain music and it just lifts my mood, you know. And if I'm thinking too much all over the place and play a certain a uh, soft piece or something you know that grounds me completely like wow brings me to peace yeah so all that i don't use it for uh, for films like a lot of actors do ha coffee yeah i don't do that i use perfumes for perfumes yeah. i think this is my driving sense the old factory sense i think i i get a lot of lot more from my uh from the sense of smell than uh, other senses wow Wow. Yeah, I re- I usually I walk into a place and I'm immediately reminded कि मैं ये कहाँ पहले कहाँ लेके जाता है मुझे. Like the smell takes me to wow. places. 
म्यूजिक पे एक वन ऑफ द फाइनल क्वेश्चन एक बहुत रैंडम सवाल ए आर रहमान के दो गाने चूज वन और रहमान इज ऑल्सो इन दो हंड्रेड सॉन्ग्स सो आई एम स्टिल लिस्निंग टू जिया चले एंड आई एम स्टिल लिस्निंग टू रोजा सॉन्ग्स एंड बॉम्बे सॉन्ग सो रहमान इज इसल या दो जो गाने मैं आपसे पूछना चाहता हूँ चूज वन कौन फाया कौन या ख्वाजा मेरे ख्वाजा कौन फाया कौन एनी पर्टिकुलर रीजन I connect more to that Haan. that piece of music, and I think uh, yeah I, I lose myself more to that piece of yeah. music, yeah. and that could be the only. But I have a, a big big love for Rahman. I met him at IFA. I couldn't contain my excitement. And uh, one question, which I ask all guests, is that a product that you purchase for less than ten thousand rupees, which you will recommend to everyone, any such thing. I think get a mechanical watch or machinery. It's a really good one. Get get a mechanical watch or machinery. It's a really good one. मिल जाएगी दस हजार से कम में हाँ ढूंढो की मिल जाएगी एंड दीज आर वेरी चीप वॉचेस रिटेल में दो दो या ढाई हजार की है एच एम टी वेबसाइट पर मिल जाएगी तो एंड देर स्टिल मेकिंग गॉट इट सो इफ यू लकी यू विल फाइंड इट गॉट इट इट्स फॉर टू थाउजेंड और टू थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड रुपीज दी एच एम टी मैकेनिकल वॉचेस सो इट्स अ रियली गुड वॉच टू हैव गॉट इट गॉट इट एंड या मैंने आपसे मूवीज बुक्स म्यूजिक शोज सारी चीजों की बातें कर ली एनीथिंग जिसके एंड से जो मैंने कोई ऐसा सवाल ना पूछा हो जिसके बारे में आप बात करना चाह रहे हैं हमने इस चीज़ की बात नहीं की बट आपका बड़ा मन हो ऐसे तो कुछ याद नहीं आ रहा है बट थिंक वी स्पोक अबाउट लॉर्ड ऑफ थिंग कितना टाइम हो गया बात करते करते हमें मैंने देखा नहीं वन आवर वन आवर ओ दिस वॉज योर क्विको वन वो मेरे को वहाँ से देख भी रहते थे नो नो वी कैन गो ऑन वी कैन गो ऑन या अरे ग्रेट वैसे थोड़ा डर रहे लगे नहीं नहीं एक क्वेश्चन विजय मैं आपसे पूछना चाहता हूँ एक ये जो इम्तियाज अली कॉन्सेप्ट है कि टूटे हुए दिल से ही संगीत निकलता है सो डू यू थिंक यू नीड टू हैव योर हार्ट ब्रोकन टू क्रिएट आर्ट नॉट नेसेसरीली आई हैव सीन टू मेनी ब्रोकन पीपल हु डोंट डू एनी थिंग अबाउट इट सो इट्स नॉट इसेंशियल बट आई फील एनी बडी हु इज विलिंग टू फेस दैम अपनी सच्चाई को जो जानने की कोशिश कर रहा है वो एंड द प्रॉब्लम इज दैट इट हैपन्स वेन यू आर डाउन इन द पिट्स द सेल्फ रिफ्लेक्शन और लुकिंग एट योर सेल्फ इन द क्लियर पिक्चर लुकिंग एट योर वीकनेसेस योर ड्रॉबैक्स योर स्ट्रेंथ्स पीपल डोंट फील मच वेन दे आर हैप्पी हैप्पीनेस इज is sort of a numbness wow. you know so jab girta hai insaan tab usko bahut sari cheeze dikhti hai but with arts what happens is if if you are able to find an outlet to how you are feeling and usually that's a sign that this person is an artist or not is is their way of finding an expression to that तो टूटा हुआ दिल इज 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 एन इंसिडेंट बट वॉट यू डू विद इट इज फाइंडिंग अ वे टू कम्युनिकेट थ्रू इट थ्रू दैट इंसिडेंट एंड सो या आई फील वेन यूर डाउन एंड एंड डाउन इन द पिट्स वेन यू वेन यू फॉल सम पार्ट ऑफ यू वॉन्ट्स टू सेव योर सेल्फ एंड सम पार्ट ऑफ यू वॉन्ट्स टू बर्न द वर्ल्ड जला दूंगा मैं सबको and then you go through phases of it no when you when your heart is broken you go through several phases first of all is denial sometimes you just say ki ye kaise ho gaya and sometimes you go through uh you know uh, anger you go through self hatred you go through hatred for others then you try to blame somebody then you don't have anybody to blame and then you find something inside you then you want to fix that so it's a lot of things happen in that process sometimes great art is made because you find yourself wow and people who find themselves are able to authentically create something new wow mai ko aapki wo line bahut achhi lagi happiness leads to numbness yeah maine aise kabhi socha nahi iske bare mein ki yeah ki people feel lesser when they are happy uh yeah it brings contentment like everything that is happening outside of you you are numb to it because you're just happy hmm duniya mein kya chal raha hai in a way also it leads to laziness i don't know yeah ha it will even in in ad inadvertently 
आपको हिंडोल की एक बहुत कुल चीज बताओ सर इंदौर से इनका नाम है हिंडोल 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 एच आई एन डी ओ एल Wow, it sounds like a brand and a very big brand. Yeah, <laughs> you can name any film from last hundred years huh. of Bollywood, and he'll tell you the year which it came in. In Bollywood. In Bollywood, any film in last hundred years. Wow. We did this with Anurag Kashyap sir in in the episode with Anurag Kashyap sir also. Two eyes, twelve hands. Nineteen fifty-seven. I think. And Chota uh, Chetan. We went to watch that film in school. <laughs> school se leke gaye the first 3D film on big screen was Chota Chetan. Yeah, this is the whole school thing. Haan. Abhi kaun si film leke jaate hain school wale bachon ko? Haan. Leke jaate hain? I don't. Aaj kal ke bache? Yar koi bata na comment section mein if the kids Haan. are watching it because my content is not watched by kids. मुझे किड्स का बच्चों से मुझे कुछ पता नहीं चलता बिकॉज आई डोंट थिंक दे आर माय ऑडियंस आप बच्चों को बोल देते हो ना कि पापा छोड़ के चले जाएंगे नो इट इज आई मीन फ्यू फ्यू ऑफ माय सीरीज एंड शोज एंड फिल्म्स हैव बीन फेयरली एडल्ट इन नेचर हां नॉट जस्ट एक्चुअली बट देयर सम टाइम वायलेंस एंड स्टफ लाइक दैट सो या यू नो आई आल्सो वांटेड टू टेक डॉक्यूमेंट्री रिकमेंडेशन फ्रॉम यू व्हिच आर द डॉक्यु सीरीज या डॉक्यूमेंट्रीज यू आर लाइक वेरी पैशनेट अबाउट I think the first documentary that got us all sh- shaken was probably Food Inc. Which one? Food Inc. I don't know. Uh, it's about the fuck all practices happening in the food industry. Ah. And yeah, it was 90s guy. So FTI me dekha tha. Maine mere hill gaya. Chicken kaise ban raha hai? Corn ka kya concept hai? Corn flakes kaise aaye? Kitna marketing tha uske piche? What is bread? What is happening at KFC? all such things are exposed like how peter uh, who is that uh, guy who made 911 i i know who michael, michael moore. moore yeah michael moore level of yes expose in food inc yeah uh, and then uh, uh, i i thoroughly enjoyed the uh, uh, last dance because mm. we all got into sneakers because of that um there's a documentary called jinx the jinx or jinx yeah. It's a fascinating story of uh, so succession देखी है ना हाँ. मैं succession नहीं देखी है हाँ. मैंने दो episode देखा था succession का then I felt it was very hectic and I couldn't deal with it What? did you feel like that in the first few episode that's too hectic yeah 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 और उन्होंने बनाया भी ऐसे हैं सारे cameras बहुत हिल रहे हैं सब कुछ कुछ भी starting नहीं है so I felt like थोड़ा सा अभी मैं काम होना चाहता हूँ like I can't watch something that hectic but I want to watch yeah. succession it succession is about very rich family in new york yes, no yes Something yes like that. yes so take that in real life okay and there's a five fifth richest new york uh, real estate family ha ah, usme se ek heir of the family something is not right with this guy and now he's 80 in what sense not right his life has been surrounded by controversies ah people he was associated with disappeared his lover mother died mysteriously woman he was with uh, disappeared so stuff like that was happening and there's a breakthrough moment in that documentary and i don't want to say it and re- and kill kill the uh, story but you cut it out i'll tell you right now oh dude pad gayi meri It's like that uh, Sasha Baron Cohen tried to <laughs> get get who's that uh, soccer player who got into a lot of trouble. Uh, this uh, uh, the famous black football player. This guy, huh? Ronaldinho. No, no. Uh, old, uh, old, old. Uh, no, that. Pele. No, uh, American ball player. The glove didn't fit. Wala, who is he? O.J. O.J. Simpson. O.J. Simpson. Simpson. Yeah. 
OJ Simpson. Nah, Sasha Baron Cohen got uh, got OJ Simpson. Nah, OJ Simpson in one of his shows. Have you seen it? No. Uh, I, I, this is America or uh, Have you seen that show? I haven't seen. So I'm a big lover of uh, Sasha, Sasha Baron Cohen. Ha, uh, so he's probably one of the most definitive artists that affected me. Nice. Uh, because uska bura dekh ke mera ha mere hawa ud gayi. Main kahi what is this? Is this real? Not real? Fake? How fake? How real? You know, it's just so the lines are merging so much, and it's a clown at the end of it. It's such a beautiful rap. So, and his Ali G interview. So, usne try kiya usne ah. apna uh, Sasha Baron Cohen ne. He played a certain character to kind of interview with O.J. Simpson and tried his luck at. Ah. अगर मुझे बोल देगा क्या? ये वो Ali G वाले interviews हैं हाँ. हाँ. Ali G वाला नहीं. He's made a show called uh, uh, This Is America. Uh, so there's a childish gambino song called Who is America, right? This is America. Uh, that is. Who is America? Childish gambino is This is America. 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 This is Wow. Or uh, truth seeking. Oh, this is going to be my top recommendation. Ha. Huh. Yeah. It's mind blowing. Who is America? Who is America? Wow. And if you don't get it, then guys, you know what to do. Ha. Crazy. And uh, uh, and other documentaries, I'm sure. Docu series, so many on Netflix. Have you seen True Crime? I'm sure you've seen. No, no. Have you seen True Crime? 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 Have you seen With their confessions, or if they spoke any time, or whatever. Have you seen Mind Hunter? Dekha? Mind Hunter, I have seen. I love it. Yeah. It's such a great show. I was very sad that it's not getting a re- yeah. renewal. Yeah. Uh, but I think I saw like maybe couple of days, then I got really harrowed. Hmm. Uh, and then I said, "Ki nahi dekh sakta main. Uh, I find a way to play this without, you know, fucking my brain." <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah. So I fo- I focus on the niceness of the guy. <laughs> <laughs> do you have a? This is a question like uh, Hindal uh, asked some of our guests. Do you have an inner monologue, जो आपकी एक आवाज़ जो constantly चलती है, जिससे आप बात करते हो, जो आपको बताती है क्या करना है? I think होगा, but sometimes we don't uh, realize that there's so much chatter happening. It's only when you're like, uh, and if you have people who can, who are observant around you, they'll tell you, क्या हुआ? Something is And you're like, oh fuck! I was probably caught up in my own head. You know? Yes. So sometimes you don't realize, but there is there are like there are times when I, I think one place I find myself speaking aloud, Haan. and it's been consistent for the last so many years that. Oh, one time when I'm just saying it alone. Yes. That time when I'm sitting, watching something, I'm watching TV, something is going on, I'm enjoying it. I'm like, hmm, something I should eat. ये मैं जोर से बोलता हूँ इवन वेन यू आर अलोन कुछ खाना चाहिए सो आई डोंट नो वाई आई से दिस लाइन अलाउड एंड दिस टाइम लाइक मैगी है सो आई 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 वर्बलाइज आई एम हंगरी एंड वॉट इज इन द किचन एंड लेट्स मेक दिस सो And this has happened so many times that I'm now aware that this happens to me when I'm alone. <laughs> <laughs> this is so cool. So one of the, one of the topics that we could we I watch a lot of uh, like uh, stand up comics. I oh. enjoy watching comedians. So when I sit by myself at home and I have nothing to do, I'll even if I'm eating a meal, I'll just switch the TV on and watch some comic. So that's my go to. चलो इस पे हम प्रॉपर सेगमेंट करेंगे पहले इंडियन स्टैंड अप सीन की बात करते हैं हुआ योर फेवरेट स्टैंड अप कॉमेडियंस इन इंडिया आई आई एंजॉयड आई एंजॉय जाकिर अ लॉट आई एंजॉय वरुण ग्रोवर अ लॉट इनका कुछ भी आएगा तो मैं देख लेता हूं कुनाल कामरा इज वन ऑफ माय फेवरेट्स तो ये तीन मेरे टॉप टॉप 3 एंड आई एंड आई एम आल्सो लाइक एविड तन्मय भट्ट चैनल वाचिंग पर्सन तो वो रिएक्ट करता है पाकिस्तानी अरे आप देखते हो बहुत मस्ती करता है वेरी नाइस या बट 
but i have seen so much of it like i've seen i enjoyed dev chapel a lot uske maine charo special dekh liye hain and there's a com- uh, there's a comedian called norm mcdonald yes uh norm mcdonald ke maine har clip dekh liye he is the funniest i watch a lot of snl also nice so a lot of snl stuff which are your favorite snl monologues monologues jo starting mein i don't remember much i'm uh, more of the skit guy ah uh, so, which are your favorite skits uh i think uh, there's, a, <laughs> there's a kissing family <laughs> which is very uncomfortable to watch uh, uh and it was the peak oh, snl cast days like uh, there was kristen wiig bill hader fred amison uh the ted lasso guy who uh, jason sudeikins oh, oh. all of them were there you know it's like uh, yeah. really all like royal rumble of yeah. uh, of snl times so there's a very stupid there's the skit where the family is extra uh, affectionate huh. so everybody kisses everybody when they meet <laughs> so that's the premise a guy comes and uh, brings the girlfriend for the first time home or brings the boyfriend for the first time home and they meet several of these and everybody is overtly <laughs> kissy so then they kept pushing the boundary to a place where they are like blowing each other's uh, blowing air into each other's mouth and passing it around the oh. room and just went bizarre <laughs> it's very uncomfortable to watch but super hilarious because everybody is cracking up <laughs> they all crack up oh and uh, there's a there's a rather <laughs> character that <laughs> Again, it's again very shocking and disgust. Disgusting is a character called Regine, which Fred Fred Armisen plays. Uh, it's like a ultra hyper left liberal, um, a feminist, environmentalist. Everything, everything <laughs> in one person. But she's a bitch. <laughs> It's such an incredible character. <laughs> oh, dude! I'm sure you've seen K N Peel ke bhi uh, like dekhi. No, I haven't. Ah, jo Jordan Peel ke like he. I know also. I've heard about uh, them, but I and I just stick to my. Uh, maybe someday I'll just yeah. go down that. Yeah. K N Peel was there. I'm thinking. even uh, dev was doing uh, dev chapel shows which were iconic at that time but i didn't i didn't see much of it yeah and any other stand up comic jo uh, koi specials particular specials ki bhi hum baat kar sakte hain ha i think uh, dev chapel's uh, uh this the one there where he talks about uh, it starts with uh, i met oj simpson for four times in my life <laughs> the first time i met him is at and then he goes into a story and so he ends at a certain place or does it not you don't know and then he says the second time i met so jason so he put the entire uh, and entire stand up was around the four times he met so jason and he said so much is one of the most iconic i I'm, i'm forgetting uh, the name of the show no nah, it's one of the four netflix spe- uh, special that he did and i think i enjoyed ricky gervais supernatural also it's very good uh, it's it's again yeah. uh, some of the comics makes you very like oh god Did uh-huh. I just laugh at this? Yes, you know, yeah. and I feel like that's. I think that's where I I like my comedy. Lovely. I want to know like uh, Hindal and like these people also had a few questions for you. So we'll start with Hindal if you have any questions. Yeah. Uh, I had a question, but now I have a recommendation for you. Huh. Uh, have you seen Anthony Jesselnik the comedian? So his joke was that like dark humor, which makes you uncomfortable. His joke is. चलो ग्रेट एनी क्वेश्चन the process of an actor acha ha no process is basically how to get the job done right everybody has their own process of doing the job um uh, to each his own i feel like uh like uh, if i uh, aur isme mera bhi ek wo question hai do you uh, judge or look up to people who are into method acting method acting pe bhi t- agar aap bata sakte i have not yet met a method actor ah ha huh. Uh, you get into a zone yes uh, but nobody is living a life like that person yeah. i think uh, i think adarsh is somebody who tries to do 
something in that direction he tries to immerse himself Adarsh Gaurav ha ah. ha uh, but uh, you know it really uh, i think whatever works for you to get there the idea is you get there because if you're not if you're not if you're not getting there then it's seen like dikh jata hai aur matlab it could be celebrated log bol rahe hai ki bahut acha kaam kiya hai but you know people who know they know ki yaar ye you know this is functional work this is not like yeah. you know next level so process is uh, process is important for everybody but it has to be your process it has to be like what is my process uh, कि मुझे लैंग्वेज पे काम करके मेरा प्रोसेस आई नीड टू साउंड लाइक द पर्सन दैट बिलोंग्स टू सर्टन लैंड लाइक अगर मैं राजस्थानी प्ले कर रहा हूँ और मैं बोल नहीं पा रहा हूँ तो मेरे लिए वहीं फेल हो गया अगर ट्रू अगर मैं हैदराबादी प्ले कर रहा हूँ और नहीं बोल पा रहा हूँ तो वहीं फेल हो गया अगर ट्रू लाइक इन मिर्जापुर एवरीबडी स्पीकिंग सर्टन काइंड ऑफ यूपी डायलैक्ट नो इन मिर्जापुर माई कैरेक्टर इज बेस्ड इन सिवान बिहार सो आई फेल आई वॉज लाइक आई कॉन्ट साउंड लाइक एनी ऑफ दिया and if i sound like any of them then it's a failure yeah for me uh so then i watched a lot of uh, kanaiya kumar uh, ah. interviews uh, pankaj tripathi interviews ravish kumar speak manoj tiwari speak because ah. i have never been to bihar so inko sun sun ke fir maine notes oh. banaye like in uh, pink uh i was i was supposed to play a delhi boy and i had never been to delhi before this before the film and so i wanted to sound like a delhi boy and i'm a marwadi from from hyderabad um so then i was like kya karu kya karu uh, it's a great idea to came to me i started watching uh, rodies delhi auditions <laughs> and uh, splits villa delhi auditions oh wow aur wahan par bol rahe bhai tu kar de bhai bhai apni baat ho ke baddi teri yaar is tarah ki jo baat karte na wo log ki bhai tu kariyo to wahan se maine ek ek ko ye 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 isne aisa bola acha isne aise bola acha i picked up two three things from boys and there was this one girl who was speaking in such a interesting way that i picked up something from her so then phir bana ke pink mein dal diya bahut sahi for lovely <laughs> and some of the rodis auditions are a treat to watch yeah maza aa jata any of them can make it to pink <laughs> <laughs> great stuff vijay and uh, this was amazing aur humne itni sari baatein ki thank you so much aapne itna time diya hame and like i said like you are one of my favorite uh, actors in india maine aapko message kiya tha insta pe mere ko yaad hai ki your performance in the hard reminded me of irfan and aapne ek bahut achhi line likhi thi maine uska snapshot liya tha ki irfan hum sab mein ha is duniya is desh mein jitne bhi artist hai sabke andar hai irfan that was beautiful thank you so much vijay this was amazing mujhe bahut maza aaya vaibhav ke sath baith ke chal chitra talks karne mein main chahta hu ki aap log sab is channel ko subscribe kare like kare share kare यहाँ पर सिनेमा के बारे में और आर्टिस्ट आर्टिस्ट के की रूह को जानने के हिसाब से बहुत अच्छी बातें होती हैं तो देखें थैंक यू सो मच थैंक यू दिस अमेजिंग सी वाई सो आई होप आप लोगों को आज का एपिसोड पसंद आया अगर आपने एपिसोड यहाँ तक देखा है तो आप हैशटैग में आप वर्ड यूज कीजिए हैश टैग इन एड वर्ड टेंट इन एड में इन से रिलेटेड कोई भी वर्ड यूज कर दीजिए बस इट शुड स्टार्ट विद हैश टैग आई एन ठीक है यूज योर फेवरेट वर्ड स्टार्टिंग विद आई एन एज अ हैश टैग इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन एंड आई होप यू गैज आर लाइकिंग द वीडियोज वी आर मेकिंग फॉर यू गैज ऑन चलचित्र टॉक्स लाइक आई सेट ये सारी की सारी रिकमेंडेशन जो चलचित्र टॉक्स के आज के आपने एपिसोड में देखी सब नोकियो पे अवेलेबल है इसके अलावा भी वी हैव बीन पुटिंग आउट सम अमेजिंग रिकमेंडेशन ऑन नोकियो नोकियो पे यू गैज कैन ऑल्सो सेंड अस योर रिकमेंडेशन पीपल कीप सेंडिंग मी देयर रिकमेंडेशन ऑन नोकियो और मेरे को लगता है हाँ दिस इज समथिंग आई शुड वॉच सो लेटली वॉट एवर यू आर वॉचिंग just recommend it to me on nokio and i'm definitely going to check it out iske alawa there are some amazing amazing episodes which are coming on chal chitra talks we have episodes coming up with harman baweja गौरव कपूर मुनावर फारूकी ऐसे और भी बहुत सारे शानदार एपिसोड है तो बताइए कैसा लग रहा है यार आजकल आपको चलचित्र टॉक्स का कंटेंट हम हफ्ते का आजकल एक वीडियो डालते हैं बट ये जरूर ट्राई कर देगी उस पर वी हिट अ सिक्स सो लेट इस नो इफ यू आर लाइकिंग इट एंड आई विल बी बैक विद मोर एपिसोड्स ऑन चलचित्र टॉक्स